To create a fairy ball, the first thing you need to do is to go to scratch.mit.edu. Move down to the orange menu, variables. Click on make variable and type the name of your variable. To reset the variable to zero, click on events. And then use the variable menu to set the variable to zero. To ensure that the variable is displayed on the screen, you can use the show variable block to ensure it is always turned on when the game starts. To count using the variable, you use the change my variable by one block. So when I press space, change the variable by one. So if I press spacebar, you can see that the variable changes. You can then use this method to add extra variables and count using different keystrokes. To ensure that somebody doesn't accidentally hold the key for too long and count multiple times, you can add a wait block at the end. This will ensure that only one press creates one new item on the, on the variable.